Hey there, Gavin Gear here from UltimateReloader.com. In the last video, I talked about the Lyman Cyclone Rotary Tumbler, and we looked at wet tumbling with stainless pin media. We cleaned some 308 brass that I shot with a machine gun, an M60, and this brass is looking great, but now it's time to dry the brass. There's a few different ways we can do this. We could spread out a towel and let it dry overnight. We could put it on a cookie sheet and dry it in the oven, or we can do it with class and do it quickly and use something like the Lyman Cyclone case dryer. So in this video, I'm gonna unbox it. We're gonna use it to dry this brass and we're gonna see all of the features. So let's get straight to it. Okay, I've been waiting to use this for a little while. I have not seen what's in here either. So looks like we've got a bunch of trays. These are kind of the individual layers where the brass will get spread out and dry. Okay. And there's the base. Very good. Okay. I was wondering where the cord was and there it is. All right. Okay, so I'm gonna put the cases aside for a moment and we're gonna take a look at what is included here. We got the instructions, the cord, the base, and it's got a timer just like the, the rotary tumbler, the cyclone rotary tumbler. And okay, so the power card goes in the back there and got quite a few of these trays, five different trays that are included with the unit and the lid. Okay. <laughs> So I think this is gonna be pretty straightforward, but what I'm gonna do is take a quick look at the instructions and we'll get this brass drying. Okay, well that was even more straightforward than I thought in terms of the instructions and the process. All we really need to do is get one of these trays exposed and then we'll spread a layer of brass onto it. And then we're gonna put another tray on spread another layer. Okay, I'm gonna I have five different layers here, tiers. So we're gonna make sure that we're not more than kind of one case layer per per tray. Okay. Looks like we'll use four out of five at least. Alrighty. This is just the coarse sifter from the rotary tumbler. Got a few extra pins. Looks like I need to wash that out a little bit better next time. Okay, and the top tray, I'm just gonna put that in place just to kind of keep it all together. Now, all we need to do is crank this. I'm gonna crank it for a little over Eh, let's go close to three hours, why not? Okay. Now we wait. Okay, so I let this run until the timer ran out, and here we are. The timer goes from zero to three hours, which actually is about the same as the Cyclone Rotary Tumbler. It looks like the same timer unit, which is great. You can either tumble or dry, turn it, kind of forget about it, come back in a few hours, come back the next day, whatever, and you know it's not gonna just sit there and run, you don't have to babysit it, which I really like. And it looks so far like, looks like things dried out pretty well. So here's what we do. I'm gonna take the fine sifter, which has the stainless steel pins. This actually still hasn't completely dried out because I left it in the uh, sink overnight. And then we're gonna take the coarse sifter, put that on top, and then just kind of take these trays out one by one. Put the lid down here and I'm just gonna pour them. If there's any additional pins in the cases or in these drying trays, those are just gonna fall through, kind of collect on top of the other pins. So I was noticing, it looks like I need to do a more aggressive job agitating, because I do have some pins here, but uh, we can just basically pour that right into the pile of pins. Okay, so now we're ready for another cleaning session. And I really, really like this. This turned out great. 
I mean, these are <laughs> squeaky clean. And the primer pockets are, are nice and clean as well. It's, it's working great. But uh, you know, I'm new to this. So if you're an experienced wet tumbler with the stainless media, I'd love to hear your tips and tricks. Are you one of those Lemma, Shine, and Dawn kind of guys? Let us know what's working for you. And if you're looking for a tumbler and a dryer, these Lime and Cyclone units are great. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you don't want to miss any of the action here on Gavin Tube, please subscribe to the channel with notifications. Until next time, Happy shooting and happy reloading.